Road to Wellness. The Road to Wellness. <laughs> To wellness, the road to wellness. Hello, y'all. I'm Diana Brienne. I don't give advice, suggestions, information, recommendations. I just share with you my perspective on different topics, as is with this one. I hope you like, share, subscribe. All channel names are pinned to the top of the comment section below. You know, I got to thinking about the importance of feeling well and being well. You know, I'm over the age of 60 and it's all that much more of a focus over the age of 60 for me than it was even before the age of 60. Now, of course, I always took wonderful care of myself, but I especially take even more so better care of myself than I ever have because I realize more and more the importance of feeling great and feeling well. And I've gone through my own bumps in the road along the way and I've shared some of those bumps with you in other videos. And so I've also seen people that I have loved, love, and other people go through health issues and difficulties and challenges in regards to health. So I realize the importance of taking care of what you've got. You know, the road to wellness is a journey. It's not really a destination in my opinion. And so for me, I'm always working on ways to keep myself healthy, to take care of myself, to be proactive. And yet I keep it very balanced in my approach because well, I don't wanna be so rigid that I'm not enjoying life. So I want to enjoy life while I'm focused on wellness. For me personally, I work out every day. I get out on the running trail. I eat healthy, I juice, I drink healthy water. And most importantly for me personally is my sleep. I, when I have a great night's sleep, it can just make me feel so amazing when I, when I wake up. And I like that feeling of feeling amazing. It's amazing what a great night's sleep can do for a person. And I know that because I've had times where I didn't sleep so well. And when I do sleep well, I feel fantastic. And so I put my focus, first of all, on my sleep, on my rest, then on my exercise, on what I eat and what I choose not to eat because some foods just don't work well for me, whereas other ones do. We all have to find what works best for us. I don't believe that there's a one size fits all for people. I believe that everyone has to find what works well for them. I will just say that wellness is a journey and not necessarily a destination in my opinion. And so the road of wellness should be a lifelong road that is focused on because no matter what else is going right in our life, if we don't feel well, we're likely not going to embrace whatever else it, it is good, good going on in our life as well as we can when we feel well. So the importance for me is to keep my focus on the road of wellness. From my house to yours, may God bless you. I hope you like, share, subscribe, and I hope to talk to you soon again. Bye-bye.